We can't go back to the nature reserve now. Well, Isaac's not here, so we can snoop around as much as we like. That wasn't a reverse image, I guess. It was the same. Okay. Wait, no, not this. Let's open the cabinet. Locked. Right, and we don't have a key for that. It seems like there's a- I searched a... that already. Let's search the portrait. Something behind it, maybe. A hidden safe. There's also a poem here, written by Father Bill. That's convenient. I copied it to my notepad. Oh, good. Let's, uh, read it. I lie in the center of the mark of the Lord. My wife gazes down as my sons stand below. I witnessed three dawns, felt warmth on my skin. Their radiant bronze lay nearby, not within. From east to west, I touched every soul. From lasting to brief, their parts made a whole. Okay. So this is... Just old furniture and... Thank you. An electronic safe with a new... So it's a number I'm combination. Guessing. Most people use numbers they can relate to, like important dates to them. 1971? It's gotta be something... It's gotta have something to do with that poem. The code to the safe must be hidden somewhere in this poem. Right, of course. Father Bill mentions his wife and children. Maybe there are some connections to his family? <sighs> Let's combine poem with, <laughs> with the safe. Okay. I'm sure there's a hidden meaning in this, but I think I'm missing something in order to make sense of it. Missing something? I'm sure... Okay, there's something- okay, so we need something else, huh? Church without... In the text, Father Bill's family members are used as reference points. Uh-huh. Could he be referring to the physical layout of the graves? Maybe. I copied the grave layout to my notebook next to the poem. Oh, that was- that was nice. Okay. Ooh. These graves must somehow correspond to Father Bill's poem. Let's see if I can figure it out. Uh, I lie in the center. My wife gazes down as my son stand below. Why? Who's his wife? Oh God. Let's see. Look at all their death dates. 79, 79, 82, 83, 73, 82, 81. There's Isaac, so he's still alive. I'm not sure what I'm doing here. What am I doing here? Isaac's one of his sons. Who's his other son? Joshua. And then his wife is Henrietta. No, that connection doesn't make sense to me. I'm not really sure what I'm doing! What am I doing? Of course! The sign of the Lord! What?! Some of the graves can form the shape of a cross! What the hell?! Now, if I can only figure out which dates are relevant... What?! I witnessed three dawns... Felt warmth on my skin, their radiant bronze lay nearby nut within. Okay. So these aren't important. Three dawns. Oh. You witnessed three dawns. That, that, and that. Three dawns should be three birth dates, but I'm not sure if those are the right ones. What? But they were the only three you could have witnessed. Three dawns. You didn't witness that one. Three dawns. Yes, that must be it. Three dawns mean three births, and they're all adjacent to Father Bill's grave. Oh, nearby, sure not within. No, I just have to somehow narrow down these to the correct number of digits. That was just trial and error. I'll be honest. I didn't know what I was doing there. I had no idea. 
From east to west, I touched every soul from lasting to brief. Their parts made me a whole. What am I selecting here? From east to west. Oh, God. From east to west? Okay, east to west could mean one year, one day, one month. So starting with the year, and then we pick a day, and then we pick a month. I'm sure the year is correct, but I think I messed up the format for the day and the month. This has to be it. Oh, God. Sorry. Uh, this has to be it, then. From lasting to brief. Ah! Year, month, day. That's gotta oh, be it. My God. There were two hints for it. I just didn't catch the other one. Oh my god. I was thinking lifespan from lasting to brief. And I was like, well, that doesn't make me that doesn't make any sense because we have to start with Joshua. 611122. God, thank you, game, for holding my hand through that. That was. I was <laughs> I was seriously struggling with that. I got the dumb briefcase one. I think that one was harder than the briefcase one, personally. Well now we just gotta try it, right? Let's try it on the safe. What's in there? Have I mentioned lately that I'm really enjoying this game? Because I'm really enjoying this game. Okay, let's go to the church. Let's do it, Kathy. What's gonna happen? Ah, click. I don't know why, but I want I really wanna like travel to the other world and duke it out with the red man. Who is he? Okay, here's here's my theory at this moment in time. And I was thinking about this when he was appearing. And uh, in the woods, and Nathan was talking about how Lily and him always fought. Is it possible that he and the kid in the graveyard, because he talked about them both being unwanted and discarded, is it possible that Lily also went through the same thing that Kathy did and lost her own son? who could be the Red Man, because if she drowned in 76 and it's 95 now, the age, you know, he'd be in his 20s, I guess? Well, she was 16 at the time. I don't know, I don't know, it's something to think about though. I feel like there's some sort of bond shared there, and it may explain why he was always fighting with Lily. Okay, so uh, what was it, uh, six, one, 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 two, two. I don't know how I remember these things, it just... Blessed. Hashtag blessed. found a bunch of torn out Bible pages and a tape in there. It was a really easy number to remember, to be honest. Okay, so what we got here? Bible pages? Was this another fucking... The Mending? This is what the Red Man's always talking about. The Mending is the sacred unity with God and the only way to reach true salvation. The Crimson One... The Red Man finds lost souls, he's the soul collector, on behalf of God. Unshackled by time, he guides them and bestows wisdom upon them. He grants them dreams and visions, preparing them for the mending. The living menders, he referred to Lily as a mender, must then descend upon the stairs of judgment. Each step reflects a piece of their soul. Then they must face their shadow self, a servant of God, their shadow self, because there was a black and white version of the Red Man too who will oppose them at every turn. He was playing chess with him. Lastly, the menders shall perform the three holy sacraments. To unite with God, three holy sacraments must be performed. The atonement of the mother, the absolution of the father, the contrition for the son. God shall then gaze upon the mender, weighing their heart. The worthy shall be cleansed of sin and be allowed to reach sacred unity. FB. What the hell? The damned shall have their hearts consumed and be cast into the abyss. J.C. L.M. Lily Myers J.R. What? J.R. I, I, I know what this initial is for, but I don't know the others. Interesting. Uh, what are you gonna write down? The crimson one. That's obviously the fucking red man, right? Maybe not. Damn! Maybe I don't get this. Okay, so what do we gotta do here? What's this micro cassette? Hey! Gonna listen to it with the dictaphone. Okay. 
This is William T. Price. My visions concerning my sons are troubling. I've watched them become corrupted with pride, turning their backs on our prophet, the crimson one. I've seen the history of the church wiped clean, replaced with trickery and lies. This message is part of a fail-safe should these predictions come to pass. I've hidden it so that only the true agents of the old God, selected by the Crimson One, may find it. Now, heed these words. You must stare into the abyss and let the abyss stare back into you. It's the only Quoting way to Nietzsche, clean huh? yourself of sin and achieve true salvation. May God be with you. It doesn't strike me as a person who would quote Nietzsche, but okay. What the hell is going on? JR is Joseph Rain. Ah, let me take a look at this again. I don't know why it didn't click immediately. There's just, there's so much to think about. <laughs> it's Father like... must have wanted to hide these for a reason. Yeah, okay, so LM is Lily Myers. JC is, um, uh, Cocky, uh, Jimmy Cochran. Jimmy Cochran, Lily Myers, Joseph Rain. Who is FB? Franklin Goldfarb. No, no, no. B. I don't know. Have we met an FB? Uh, uh, Charles Wade. No, that's CW. I don't know who FB is. Hey, you're back. Yep. Have to fill out I my am. statement. You guys want my statement? Yeah, the sheriff is waiting for you. All right. Great. Let's talk, Sheriff. And that's when I found that creep with her tied up in the crypt. Jesus. I had my suspicions about that church, but I never thought it went this deep. Yeah. So, what happens now? I'll call the judge and get a warrant. We find anything else, that bastard won't get away with it. Okay. Can I go talk to him? Go ahead. Ask Lenny to go with you if you need him. We'll oh, do. he's so friendly hey, now. Think nothing of it. Oh, all, all we needed for the little cooperation was a little honesty. Imagine that, Kathy. Well, he was very not willing earlier. Okay, I don't need Lenny with me. We can handle this. Kathy can handle herself. All right, Isaac. He's where he belongs. Yeah, he is. Let's talk to him. <clears throat> Hello again, my child. I hope what? you enjoy that cell as much as I did. For a man of faith, this is a room fit for a king. Speak what you will. I have all the time in the world. <sighs> Who is the Crimson One? No one that concerns the likes of you. Ooh, he got Wait, mad. So you do know something about him? Certainly, but that knowledge is not to be shared with unbelievers. Oh. Oh. Why did you destroy Lily's paintings? Is that what you think I did? Yes. pretty ruined to me. Like an ignorant child, you look only to the surface and not on what lies hidden beneath. No, I did, Are you actually. implying that the paintings contain some hidden message? Oh yes, Lily was special in God's eyes. A chronicler, a bestower of wisdom. As an emissary of God, it is my duty to unlock the divine knowledge in her work for all of mankind. This game gives me like crazy true detective vibes, but without all the without all the guns and shootouts and shit. Uh, you know they they uh, they encounter some biker gangs in that series too. True Detective season one is fantastic, by the way. Season two is uh, well we'll just we'll just move on without talking about season two. What do you really know about Lily Myers? Oh, the drowned girl is a conundrum. Why do they keep in calling life, her that? Part prophet, part mender. In death, ascended, united with the holy conduit. Did you have something to do with what happened to my grandfather? Alas, I did not. At the time, I wasn't enlightened, and neither was my father. But Grandpa showed the same symptoms as Eileen. Then he was claimed by God, without my guidance. Praise him. I can't roll my eyes hard enough. I can try. 
I don't think I did it justice. Okay. Tell me what you did to my friend, Isaac. I offered her to God, and the Lord accepted her with open arms. She is part of his world now. You're not talking about a Christian God. Of course not. I'm talking about the old God, slumbering in the darkness beyond. Ooh, what some... are you saying? You offered Eileen's soul to this God of yours? She is but one of many. I guided them all to the stairs of judgment. Wait, so you were responsible for all those people disappearing? Going crazy? All I did was bring them face to face with God. If they chose to reject him, they were beyond redemption. Huh. What is your church really about, Isaac? What are you trying to accomplish? The same as any other church. All we want is the salvation of mankind. Mm. By any means necessary? Clearly kidnapping isn't out of the question. Unnecessary evil. I look at the bigger picture, the greater good. One day you'll understand. You are quite obviously mm. brainwashed. I'll stop you, if it's the last thing I do. You can try, child. I have God on my side. God, what a fucking smug, condescending asshole. Oh my god. Look what I found in the church, Isaac. Hmm. Come to gloat, have you? I see that you've added stealing to your list of sins. Oh, shut the fuck Honestly, up. Honestly, I just want to understand. What does it all mean? The mending? I don't believe you're sincere for a second. I will speak of this no longer. Oh, you want, will ya? Huh? Listen to this, Isaac. This is William T. Price. My what is this? Concerning my sons are troubling. I've watched them become corrupted with pride, turning their backs on our prophet, the crimson one. I've seen the history of the church wiped clean, replaced with trickery and lies. This message is part of a failed thing. I don't believe it. Father saw all of this coming. God, have I strayed from the faith? Oh, you think? It's not too late to redeem yourself, Isaac. I've met the Crimson One. We are on the same side. Preposterous. No one has witnessed that apostate since Father's death. Apostate? I've been north of the lake, but he's nowhere to be found. He abandoned us all, and the divine work now rests upon my shoulders. You believe that you are carrying out the work of the Crimson One? Don't think I can't hear that mocking tone of yours. I will speak of this no longer. Uh, you already said that. He mentioned north of the lake. That's yeah. part of Conwell Woods. I'll probably have to narrow it down more, but it's something. New location added. All right, Kathy, let's GTFO. Bye forever, Isaac. Hope you're rotten Father, there. Have you abandoned me? I will atone for my sins. I swear it. Now you got God your helmet on. on me. Well. This is, uh, interestingly, he was talking about the old God. This is some Lovecraftian shit going on here, man. Ah, there it is. Let's go back to the storage facility, because I feel like I missed something here. I, there's got to be something in here that I missed. I don't know where, but... So that's where Grandpa's old uniform... Something glowing, maybe? Something glowing? Nothing useful. Just some old newspaper. I'm so confused. There's gotta be something in here. What? Why, there. why didn't you do this earlier? I There's clicked on those. Else. You guys saw it. I How clicked on those. Heel form for me. July fifteenth, nineteen eighty-one. I don't believe it. He he tried to get me back from my mom, right to the very end. Pull yourself together, Kathy. Man, good thing I came back. Let's listen to this shit. 
Ba da ba 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 ba. Play that shit. This is Joseph Rain. Operation Log Part Four. August eighth, nineteen eighty one. The area appears to be circular with along the outer perimeter. I've determined that some kind of endothermic reaction is taking place. So it's important to be observant of changes in temperature. Find the source by severing the link. Perhaps I can save them, Jimmy and all the others. Reoccurring dream. I'm standing in front of a huge black hole in a clearing in the woods. There's a man dressed in red, urging me to jump. I'm afraid to, but I take the plunge anyway. For some reason, I don't think I have anything to lose. As I'm falling, I reach for the parachute cord. But to my horror, there's nothing there. That's when I wake up. What? Just some old news. Okay, no, close your knapsack, please. All right, we gotta go. We gotta go to the uh, the woods, I guess, and find this black hole. Okay, remember what I said earlier about, like, maybe the red man is, or the crimson one, or whatever. Maybe he's related to Lily. Maybe not. Because now that I remember, Nathan did say that he hasn't aged in 30 years, or whatever. So, maybe not. So he's been seeing the red man for 30 years. The hell? North, east, south. What? North. This is a maze, guys. Come on, no. It's one of these. Out oh, west! Damn it, this is a classic point and click. Where's my- where's my bike?! Oh, that is not what, what just the, happened. How did I get back here? I must be going in circles. Yeah, I I am. I got freaked out just now because I went up and then I went back down and I wasn't in the same place anymore. Oh no. Maybe something something in here will help me. Some kind of endothermic reaction is taking place. So it's important to be observant of changes in temperature. Find the source by severing the link. Perhaps I can save them. Jimmy and all the others. Okay, he said, and I've been waiting for this. He said, endothermic and be aware of changes in temperature. That thermometer outside the cabin. I've been waiting for my chance to filch that. And we are going to filch it now. No one's here, so... They won't, they won't mind if it goes missing for a little while. Give me that. Give me that thermometer. I want that thermometer. What? I'll just borrow this for a while. That's the spirit. That confirms that I was doing the right thing there. Okay. I can't go back anymore. Ooh, I can't go back to the cemetery either. These are the only three places I can go! Guys, we're getting to the bottom of this. Alright, what are we gonna find here? What's down the rabbit hole, so to speak? <clears throat> okay, so... We're in changes in temperature. I wonder if, like... Uh... Oh, come on. How am I supposed to... So it's like two above... Middle. This thing should come in handy if I need to track temperature. Okay. I'll just have it out, I guess. Does it change at all? It's 
Looks like it's gone up a little bit. I'm trying to keep an eye on it. It's tough, though. Oh, 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 it's going down. Endothermic. So that means we need to get colder, right? Oh no, I went back up. Uh, go back down. It's gonna be tough. Ah ha ha! It went down here. In order to get out, we'll have to, uh... If it gets hotter. I hope I'm doing this right. It is getting colder. I mean, it would make sense. It gets, like, colder as it gets creepier, right? Ah! Okay. Nope. Oh, it's getting way cold over here. Go east, Kathy. Come on. Alright. How many times do we need to do this, do you think? Oh, this is the right way. My god. What is this place? What the fuck? Guys, I would have never imagined that this game would be like this when I first started playing it. Met her end. Someone left this message here for me. Yeah. Sea of flowers. It's the red scythe flower. Must be hundreds of them here. Really? So much for being endangered. Smell sea of flowers. A huge hole with no visible bottom. What's that? I can see something. Faintly. What is it? A huge hole. Are you gonna go down? Do I smell the flowers? Intense. Oh, they're making me a bit dizzy. No, Kathy! Greetings. You again. Me again. You better have some answers, Crimson One. All in due time. Your friend is being claimed by the darkness. She's standing on the brink of the abyss as we speak. What? Are you talking about Eileen? Yes. If you wish to save her, you must descend. Don't trust this guy. So, what is down there? The tribulation, the reflection of the soul. We call it the mending. No. Who's we? My kind, servants of the old god. To what end do you serve this god? What does your kind actually want? All we want is for you to take your medicine, Kathy. For you to grow and be happy. If that's the case, why were all those people hurt? Lily? Jimmy? Grandpa? You misunderstand. What one wants, and what one is able to do, are two different things. Happiness is not a one-way street. It cannot be given, only earned. Your grandfather understood that. He embraced it. Wait, you saw Grandpa? Oh yes, right here. He was a tortured soul desperate for some kind of meaning after losing the light of his life. You. He sought the power below. The vessel of redemption. But Grandpa didn't make it. He failed. How could I succeed when he wasn't able to? He was so much stronger than me. So much braver. Is that what you believe? Perhaps you don't know him as well as you think. But why me? Why are you making me do this? Because you so desperately need it, Kathy. You're haunted by your past, by all these painful memories long forgotten. 
They follow you like a shadow, pulling you down. They taint your every thought, impulse, and deep desire. It is foul to us. This is crazy. I could just walk away, get on my bike and drive, forget I was ever here. There's nothing stopping you. Eileen. Yeah. I can't leave her like that. Oh, God. I see now why he speaks so highly of you.